Monica. Oh, f hey guys, it's Natasha. So uh, my nails are still blue from uh, last week. I think my nails were also blue in last week's video. Uh, I actually had to cut my nails because at school a couple weeks ago, like one of my nails almost broke off <laughs> because it was really long. I've just been really discouraged. I didn't want to redo my nails because you know, they're short now and it's not going to be like as easy to paint them. So in this week's video, it's just going to be kind of chill. I'm just going to chat with you and do my nails at the same time. All right, so we got to start by taking off my nail polish. Uh, so finals week is uh, this week and I am really stressed. <laughs> um, a lot of my friends are like really, really angry. Like I've noticed that like, um, <laughs> I have this group chat and everyone just like kind of complains in it a lot and especially like recently everyone's been complaining and I think everyone's just really mad <laughs> because they're all stressed out because finals are happening and you know finals can really harm or help your grade so studying is like really really important. Um, I just thought making a video was a nice way to calm down and uh, forget about all of that for a bit so that's why I am making this week's video. It's so annoying because like when you use cotton to take off nail polish um, it comes off of the hand you're taking it off of, but like your nails also get stuck in the cotton and it comes off like on your fingers and it's really, really annoying. <laughs> anyway, a lot of my friends have just been really stressed and so have I. Um, I should be studying right now, but it's okay, it's fine. I feel like finals seem so like big and bad and like really, really scary when really they're, they're not. Because finals are cumulative of like everything you've learned that semester. A lot of stuff that you learn at the beginning of the semester is really, really easy stuff. So it, I feel like it, you know, isn't that difficult? I don't know. I don't know, maybe maybe it's just me. <laughs> um, in other news, my orchestra teacher has not been at school for the past like four days because he has like a music thing that he had to go to in another state. Um, and let me just tell you, if you guys are in a music collective in school, like in middle school or even high school, like regardless, like subs for band, orchestra, and chorus, are always like <laughs> the worst subs because they have no idea what they're doing. It's different when they're in like a regular class because kids can kind of like do stuff on their own. Usually like the teacher leaves like a plan or like leaves some worksheets that uh, they can hand out and the kids can work on. But with orchestra and like band and chorus, we usually play instruments every day or like sing every day. And so, and so subs don't really know what they're doing. <laughs> the sub, um, we've had an orchestra the past couple of days while my teacher hasn't been at school. Um, it's, he's uh, not like any other sub I've had before. <laughs> this is really funny. So on Thursday, um, I was really, really hungry. And so um, that morning I actually had like a student council meeting and they gave us uh, chicken biscuits from Chick-fil-A. And so I wasn't hungry like when I got it, but I was hungry later on. So I was like, oh yeah, I'll just eat it now. Like while I was in orchestra. So I started eating it and I, I ate like more than half of it. I wasn't spilling or anything. Like I was being pretty like, pretty clean with it. I wasn't like spilling crumbs everywhere. And this sub, um, what he did to get our attention was he would flicker the lights because he didn't really have a loud voice and I think that's why I didn't hear. But um, yeah, he would flicker the lights. He saw me eating and he called me over to the corner of the room and like my friends were like, like what is going on? And I was like, am I in trouble? Like, I didn't even know what was going on. So I went to the corner of the room and he was like, you must have had earbuds in so you didn't see me flicker the lights. And I was like, okay. <laughs> I mean, I, I can probably still see if I have earbuds in, but Okay, and anyway, he said that we weren't supposed to be eating and I was like, oh, okay. I don't know, he's just not the best sub. I'm really excited to see my orchestra teacher again on Monday. Oh, my nails look so weird not colored. I'm like, I'm not used to it. Oh my God. I'm gonna start painting now. Anyway, for those of you that have never done your nails before, it's always a good idea to push your cuticles back before you start painting. All right, so we're gonna start with just a little clear coat. I don't know if I'm gonna do it like this the whole time because it's gonna be really difficult if I paint my nails like this, but you know what? I will try. Um, and in this video, I'm probably only gonna do one hand because trust me, you do not wanna see me do my right hand. Definitely does not look as good as my left hand. So, all right, clear coat, done. I just rubbed my thumb on my forehead. So I like to shake my hands a little bit to let them dry. I usually have like a hair dryer in here where like I dry my nails, it dries it quicker, but that would be really, really loud and obnoxious. So I'm not gonna do that in this video. Ooh. Oh man, I am already messing this up. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> anyway, so Christmas is coming up. You guys excited? I'm pretty excited for Christmas. I'm excited for break more than anything. I, like, I feel like I really need a break from school. I know it's the weekend, but like two days? Not long enough. Guys, doing nails is a lot harder than you think. You've never done your nails before. You should do them one day. See how challenging it is, because it's very challenging. Yeah. 
It's pretty good. Pretty good for the first nail. I think that's all right. So I need to go Christmas shopping. I, we're doing another Secret Santa thing with my orchestra. Um, so I need to go buy my Secret Santa person a gift. I also need to buy presents for teachers. It's looking pretty good. I'm pretty proud of this. I'm gonna end up like hitting it against something and then it's gonna get all messed up. What I like to do is sometimes I like to make my ring finger a different color. That's something that I've been really into. Uh, one of my friends, like not to like ask me like, why is your ring finger a different color? And I was like, oh, is that not something that do. I like it, so I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I don't really care if anyone else likes it, I like it. So I've been looking for like some good Christmas music to listen to, but I can't find like any really good songs. If anyone knows any like upbeat, like fun Christmas songs, please tell me because I would love to listen to some fun poppy Christmas music. I, I need some of that. I've only found like sad songs. <laughs> I don't really like sad music. I like happy music. So if anyone has any recommendations, that would be appreciated. Comment them down below. All right, guys, I'm on to the last nail. Let me just clean it up and then we done. Ooh, I almost hit my nails against something that's not good. This like kind of pencil thing I'm using, it's just a little stick with sharp edges. Um, and so like I dip it in nail polish remover and scrape off anything that's on the sides. That's like a great way to get rid of extra stuff that's on the skin around your nail. All right, I am done with my left hand. I probably can't even see it really well because this lamp is like super, super bright, but this is what my hand looks like, so. So I might keep this on my hand for a while, for a week maybe, might change it up later, who knows, I don't know. So I apologize if this video is very boring to watch. It was really relaxing to make, so I hope it was relaxing to watch. But anyway, if you like this week's video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, that helps out a lot. Also comment down below some Christmas songs that you recommend, or comment what you're doing over the break, or comment what you're doing for Christmas. I would love to know. Other than that, you can subscribe or push the bell to get notified whenever I upload a new video, I upload every Saturday. But that is all, I will see you guys next Saturday with a new video. Bye.